You have a place to live? Yes. You worked hard in there. All your bills are paid off. They're all squared away. Follow the rules from now on. Or else you'll be seeing me right back here. Real soon. I'm not coming back. Ever. WDBS 18 Morning News Radio rounding up your news. In world news, Soviet leader Leonid Brezhnev declared his disapproval of President Reagan's communication policy, prompting many to speculate about what's to come in the next couple of months in the West and relations. In local news, millionaire Benjamin Gustav has been murdered in his home here in Baltimore last night. National and state authorities have arrived to investigate, and after some researching, they found quite a few clues. They concluded that the victim died from a stab into the lower abdomen. On-scene evidence has led authorities to conclude that the stabbing could have only been made by a unique kind of knife that is manufactured in Denmark and carved to look like a fish. Only four exist in the world. Very sad event. Uh, and Gustav was very great for established in the home area to care for those who are unfortunate. So we are very deeply disappointed. Gonna be here a long time. I can't. I do. It wasn't me. Nope. Can't do that. Can't do that either. Ah! What if they come for me? I need to relax. <sighs> it's closing all of a sudden. Make sure this with us. Gustav case? Mm-hmm. I'm the one that got the imprint made on the scene. Do you have any weeds? Well, we know that the weapon looks like this. It looks kind of like a letter opener, I suppose. And looks can be deceiving. What are you looking through? Oh, I was just looking through these bunk shots. You know, I had this thought. A lot of the guys that have been in and out of the prisons recently, they've been in for knife-related crimes, so I wonder if this particular weapon has been used before. Let me see that. Your papers, I mean. These folks look like they're kind of hide in a back alleyway and pickpocket your grandma. Not the type to murder a millionaire in the biggest house in the city. Take your VCR maybe, but murder Benjamin Gustav? I mean, it was just a thought. Well, I like the way you think, Tucker. Got any other ideas?
What's up? Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna get arrested for the Gustav murder. I'm gonna spend the rest of my life behind bars while Officer Tucker glares at me. Uh, I haven't slept in three days. All my food is expired. I almost drank milk that was expired from before my sentence. I mean, is that even okay? A lot is up, John. Wait. You killed Benjamin Gustav? It's impressive. No. I didn't. That's the problem. If you didn't kill him, then why are you worried? <sighs> they... Someone killed him using a rare knife. It has a fish on it. Well, if it's rare, the police will find it really quickly and you'll be totally fine. I'm up. I'm up. You found anything? Yeah, I've been uh, I've been working hard all day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, fortunately, I haven't stopped to take a nap. I found the four knives. Where? Well, Gustav had one. Yeah, it could have been a suicide. Possibly. The other's in a Quebec in a Danish museum. <sighs> this isn't helping. The other two belong to citizens, both local, possibly family heirlooms. One named Charles Jefferson. He's been monitored for pawn shop scams. Who's the other? Carl Thomas. He used to pickpocket and cat burgle. He was released from prison right before it happened. Do you know him? Yeah, I know him. Well, I think we should talk to him. He might have something we need to know. Just calm down. I can't just calm down. They could be showing up any moment with an arrest warrant. Don't let this anxiety control you, man. Just, I'm, I'm sure that if... We just wanted to stop by and wish you luck getting your life back together. It can get hard to get rolling again. Are you bringing me flowers? Not exactly. May we come in? Yes. Have a seat. I haven't met you yet. What's your name? Anderson. I'm a detective. Yes. I'm fine. What can I do for you? Well, this is a very curious case. No doubt you've heard of the murder of Benjamin Gustav. Yeah, it's been all over the news. Very sad. Can I see that? This? Thing? news for you, Carson. Carl. Right. Carl. Do you know that these items are exceedingly rare? There's only four known in the world. My grandpa should have bought a lottery ticket. I'm not trying to place blame here, but... The purpose of our visit is to examine this knife. That, that thing? Did you know the two of them belong to private citizens like yourself? Well, we have reason to believe that Charles Jefferson was the murderer of Benjamin Gustav. Detective, can I uh, speak with you for a moment? Jefferson's knife was found bent at the scene by one of our private investigators. Now, with your permission, we'd like to be able to use this knife in our investigation against Jefferson. It's a 
show an example of what an antique like this should look like. Yes, that would be okay. Well, thank you for your cooperation. Good to see you again. Anxiety control you. 